Is it permissible to listen to music? It is permissible to listen to music. There is no single verse that makes music forbidden, haram. On the contrary, there are two verses that can be interpreted as in the believers are to be welcomed to heaven with music. None of the hadiths that declare music forbidden are respected. Concluding this issue is a booklet named Al-Ginahul Mulhi, meaning entertainment music, which has been written competently by Ibn Hazm, the Andalusian scholar, who put an end to this issue. It is a booklet in my library that I read and annotated. Unfortunately, I don't have a translation available for it. To say that music is forbidden is fighting with the nature of the human disposition. If something permissible is to be called forbidden because of the risk of being used to accompany forbidden acts, would there be anything left in life that is permissible, including God, religion, faith, and prophet? So should we ignore prophecy altogether, since there can be false prophets? What I'm referring to is something like that. Music is rhythm. Music is sound. God is the Lord of sounds as well. Since Pythagoras, it is known that notes are based on divine mathematics. The singing of the bird, the breeze of the wind, the droplets of the drizzle, the murmur of the cat is, is music. The universe is a divine choir with music. The uninterested ear is deaf, that deafness is enough as trouble. Our songs, Ballads, musical instruments, drums, and qanun are great blessings that I enjoy. Man harrama zinnata Allahi allati akhraja lil ibadi Who has forbidden the adornment of God which he has produced for his servants and the lawful things of provision? Surah Al-A'raf, chapter 7, verse 32, says Quran. And it is about time to listen to the Qur'an.